It's been nearly a year in the making since the start of the City of Rochester's partnership with a group of artists in Australia to materialize a piece of history in the Med City. KIMT News 3 Sananda McCall has more about the Statues for Equality project. Sananda. Hey, Cami. Well, it's all in the name. The Statues for Equality project is to honor a woman in history by increasing the number of statues of women around the globe. Rochester is currently working with artists to produce a piece for Amelia Hatfield Witherstein, who was the first woman elected to Rochester School Board and the first woman to serve jury duty in Olmsted County. Mayor Kim Norton says the city is collaborating with the artists to get the bronze cast design in place and hopes to be installed sometime next year at a park in the community. Norton says Witherstein was a woman who broke the ceiling of opportunity and had a history of volunteerism and public service. And as the first woman mayor of the city, Norton says it made sense to recognize another significant woman of the past. And I also think the year I became mayor, or right after that, we were celebrating the right of women to vote for the first time. That had hit its 100th anniversary. And so there have been a lot of, I guess, signals that maybe it's time for us as a community to recognize a woman in our past. And fundraising is still going on for the statue. Mayor Norton says before the statue was sent from Australia, half of the cost needs to be paid, and the additional cost will then be paid after the statue has been delivered. Cami? Sananda, thank you so much. And we are told the cost of this project is estimated to be around $75,000. Norton says designers are making sure in to incorporate accurate clothing details based on the time Witherstein was alive.